Okay, in this lecture, we're gonna go one step beyond and this time, instead of using the interface builder to write the label text as hello everybody, we're gonna connect this label to the code and with the code, we will change what the label says, okay? So, please bear with me, go to Xcode and right here, I want you to make sure that on the top right corner, you have the left panel that appears, so show the navigator right here it needs to be blue like it's enabled and this will appear now i want you to go in the viewcontroller.swift file okay which is the file the uh, source code file that is related to the the file that we have right here in the interface builder how do i know that because it says view controller here okay so the view controller is linked to the viewcontroller.swift file all right so once you click there you see the, the content of that file. Now, what I want you to do is locate the line that it says class view controller. Okay. Once you see this line, I want you to go at the end of it and click enter. Okay. Click enter, uh, press enter a couple times. And right here, I want you to type the at sign IB outlet. Okay. And var my first label. Okay, now what's going on here? I want you to make sure that the IB outlet has an uppercase I, B, and O. Okay, so the I, the B, and the O are all uppercase. Okay, then var my first label. It doesn't matter how you write my first label, but I wrote it with an uppercase F and an uppercase L. Okay, and what I'm going to do is put a semicolon and say UI label. All right, so now once I do this, make sure that the UI label, the U, the I, and the L are all uppercase as well, okay? So as you type this, once you're done typing this, you should see on the top, uh, on the left of it, of this line, you should see a circle that appears here, okay? It's a gray empty circle. That means that it's an interface builder outlet. It knows that this needs to be connected to the storyboard okay so we're gonna go to the storyboard right here and in the storyboard we're gonna connect the uh, the label from the code to the label on the user interface right here so go to the main dot storyboard and i want you to click on the hello everybody label all right once you're there i want you to go to this panel right here and if you do not see this panel you need to have this blue selected okay and show or hide right here okay and i want you to go right there to the connection okay connection inspector and i want you to locate the referencing outlets and under the new referencing outlet i want you to click and and stay pressed on this dot and i want you to start dragging this line that you see and drag that to the view controller okay and once you're there, once you have it dragged all the way to the view controller, I want you to let go of the mouse or the, or the trackpad, okay? Let go. Once you do that, you will see my first label, okay? This is the label that we created in the viewcontroller.swift source code file, okay? I want you to click on it. All right. So as soon as you do this, now if you click on the hello everybody label, if you look in the connection, you see that the user interface label is connected with this line to the view controller file my first label okay so now if i go to viewcontroller.swift what do i see i see that the label is connected how do i know because before it used to be an empty circle now the circle is actually filled up all right so now in order to see that the connection works i want you to go under this line that says do any additional setup after loading the view typically from a nib i want you to click at the end of it and press enter a couple times okay and i want you to write in between the closing brackets and this right here okay i'm sorry it's a curly brace okay so right here i want you to write my first label and as soon as the autocomplete appears press enter if you do that it will write it for you okay pretty cool right and this actually is the same as the first label that we created and put a dot at the end and here write text okay dot text equal and here i want you to open a, a double quote and write 
hello from code okay and close the bracket oh, I'm sorry close the, 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 the double quote okay so as you can see there's one opening double quote and one closing double quote so basically what's going on is that hello from code is the text that will be assigned to the text of the label okay so we're basically changing the text of my first label all right so now once you have that done i want you to click on run you should see no error if you see any error that's because you probably are have some uh, some typo somewhere on a syntax error so make sure you have it written the way i have it here and i want you to press play okay so once you press play now it's going to start building and you should see a build succeeded there we go and now the simulator is about to pop up and what are we going to see now there you go instead of saying hello everybody we see hello from code so now we actually change what the simulator or the iphone is saying through the code good job we have one connection we have connected the phone to the code that's a big step forward see you guys in the next lecture